what you are about to see are some of the highlights of some of the interviews that were taken last year for our Here's to Life event in 2016. I know they captured my heart. Let's see what they do to yours. My friends, Tiffany Bailey. Ah! <laughs> Uh, when I was uh, 13, I uh, tried to commit suicide myself. I um, really had a hard struggle with um, my identity and how I felt about myself and just, um, you know, I had Hashimoto's and I was gaining all this weight and I just wasn't feeling very good and so I, you know, took a whole bunch of pills and wrote a note and you know, luckily um, it didn't work out because how grateful am I to be in this life and with these friends and all these things. But, you know, at the time you don't realize that your life is going to be that. And so I just say that, you know, give it a chance. Give it a chance. Don't go for it right away because, you know, there are so many blessings that um, that exist outside of that. So. Well, you're a blessing to us, Aww. Tiffany. Honest. And Amen. Linda? Yes. How in the world did you end up here today? What's what's important to you here? That this is something that I suffer with all the time, and it was my own private thing that I didn't, I've never shared, and so I was able to share that because of this event. Oh, my God. I love you, honey. She is loved by so many people. Oh, all right, my dear. So this, yeah, thank you. Thank you. All right, this is Linda Morgan. Thank you. Thank you, Linda. Thank you. Thank you, President. I have had a friend who was in college who committed suicide, and the brother of a, of a, of a boyfriend of mine committed suicide. And so I've, I've seen firsthand how that impacts families. And it's just, it's devastating for families. And, of course, for people to have that... Um, experience that level of despair and aloneness is just really um, you know it's something that this organization really is working to prevent and I think that's wonderful so we're really happy that you joined us thank you thank, thank you. you and Paul Horner yes. hello crazy Paul <laughs> crazy Paul yeah <laughs> so, um, has has suicide or anything that tragic ever come close to your life? Uh, yeah, yes, of course. Uh, I mean, a friend of mine was just found dead and nobody knew where he was, you know, and they hadn't heard from him for several days and they found him. Uh, and, you know, oh, it's just awful to, uh, you know, so um, we try and, you know, I, I, it's just so silly if I'd have made a phone call and, Stayed more in touch, but you know you can't. You, you can't always. No, you, you can't. You you can't blame yourself, uh, but it is tragic because we always think, well, if I had done that, if I had done this, maybe well, I could have or should have. And I'm and, still here. <laughs> yes, thank you for coming out. This is wonderful. Yeah. This is wonderful, Paul. Yeah. And I'm here with another musical f friend of mine, Sharon Marie Klein. Hi there, Hi. lovely. My sweetheart. <laughs> Actually, I'm fortunate not to have anyone in my life who has committed or come close. But my mother did suffer from deep depression, and I can I saw how debilitating that could be, and. Um, you know, I spent my life while she was living, um, always trying to cheer her up and remind her that somebody sees you, somebody gets you, um, and so that's that's how it's touched my life. Depression, anyway. Yeah, yeah. that's very important. How yeah. sweet. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then everybody needs to hear that. Yes, and this is Gary Brumberg. Brumberg. Yeah. Who's volunteering? He's a major jazz singer. Thank you, thank and you. And he's here volunteering. So tell me, what got you involved here? Well, first of all, uh, the jazz community is very close here in Los Angeles. We're all friends. We all support each other. We try to support each other's causes. But I also have a, a, a personal involvement in this. I had a friend who uh, committed suicide about two years ago, and he sent us a note on Facebook that he was going to do it. And uh, I can't tell you each how that affected me. And if there's anything that I can do to help the people who survive the person who takes their own life, I think it's for them as well. And uh, so I want to be here and contribute as much as I can. Oh, Gary, that's wonderful. And I'm sorry for your loss. Uh, we're here yeah. to support those people who need our help. And uh, if, 
there's anything that we can do to, to prevent them from committing suicide, we'd like to try and do that. So yes. I'm definitely here today. Yeah, and today's a great day. And even though the event will be over when you see our interviews here, you can still donate and they can receive your donations very lovingly. They will receive them. That's Thank right. you so much, Gary. We're here until 7 o'clock. <laughs> Donate, honey. 